evolve and where do you think this bloodline storyline will continue to go because we just saw the dismantlement uh, of the wise man Paul Heyman by the hands of the bloodline um, just to pretty much usher in Jacob Fatu and get all the tongues wagging but who do you guys see as the new wise man for Jacob Fatu man uh, and the bloodline inquiring minds would like to know but um, I love Jacob Fatu um, and his wrestling style in WWE I think that it is big money put money on the board you know what I'm saying? Put a put a rocket on his back and blow his ass to the moon because uh he will definitely make his mark in the W W E. Um one last thing, man. I just want to go over this <laughs> this Liv Morgan and Dominic Mysterio storyline, man. I think that uh the Liv Morgan Revenge Tour uh has definitely took a detour and kind of stayed on the real Ripley. Uh, train man and she's trying to take everything that belongs to Rhea Ripley and she already took a title she took the, the group judgment day she's kind of in and out of the locker room uh, or the clubhouse as they call it and now she got her, her talons and her claws set and sinking into Dirty Dom man and I think that this whole uh, Liv Morgan and Dominic Mysterio storyline is really picking up some traction man because Live, you know, nobody's really talking about her title right now. They're talking about the storyline that's going on between her and Dominic and what's going on. So, Liv has definitely found a lane for her, uh, for people to keep her name relevant as far as the championship is concerned. And probably this is a better run at her championship than the first one. Um, I think the first time she really had to prove for herself that she belonged there. And now she's trying to prove that she can carry on the storyline and be involved into a deep storyline and have people interested in what she's got going on. And I think that the storyline between her and Dominic Mysterio is getting really juicy and we're getting really interested. You know what I'm saying? Um, I'm going to just say it like this. In the words of Liv Morgan herself. Oh, I feel so good. I just got to get this scene. That good old hot on this thing and we're good to go. <laughs> this guy get that thing good on and spit on that thing. You know what I'm saying? Liv Morgan out here hock to it. You know what I'm saying? She, she gonna give dominate that hock to if mommy don't come back and regulate some things. You know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? How, how I got played again? Oh, I feel so good. I just gotta get this thing that good old hock spit on this thing and we're good to go. <laughs> oh yeah. Oh yeah, she know what she's doing. <laughs> she she know what she's doing. Uh, I like this live run that she's doing as champion, um, and her being involved with Dominic Mysterio is really laying down the foundation for when Rhea Ripley does come back. Um, they're definitely going to have some words and some feuding, and maybe Mommy might leave Judgment Day. Who knows? Um, we shall see. Uh. Beautiful people, thank you for joining me, man. Uh, well, appreciate it.